my account has been permanently suspended. That's right. It's not clickbait, it's actually true. I have read the emails right now. My account is suspended permanently. I have uh, sent several inquiries to them uh, asking to revert the punishment, maybe, you know, make it shorter, make it to a time ban period, and they are not willing to do that. And on some level, I can't really blame them. So before you go all out and about and say, well, how can you do that to such a passionate player like me? Well, you have to f know in which scope I have exploited the recent bug in the you know, last patch they introduced, the temple check exploit. It's not a mere case of you know me selling and reselling several sex. Um, just so we are all on the same page, what have I done? I have exploited 200 million credits. Let that sink in for a bit. Yes, 200 million credits. I can't really, I can't really honestly blame them for taking actions against my account. But you have to look at it from this, from this way. What, what, what really disappoints me in all of this is that for three and a half years my account has been in good standing. Nothing has really happened to it. I've been a good player, I've been, been decent. You know, there's been like one report for bad play behavior, but that was a warning. You know, that was basically everything that happened. And other than that, I've been a long-term subscriber since. I have never stopped subscribing, I've never stopped playing the game. I've invested uh, much time into the game, and in some level I think I have made the game more enjoyable for a lot of other players, you know, through uh, me, you know, being in the community and stuff like that. Now, the thing is, I... I understand. Action has to be taken against that, you know? Everybody that is out there and says, yo, well, you played with the fire, you're a dirty exploiter, of course you're gonna get burnt. There's a difference between getting burnt and getting, you know, uh, I don't know, your entire legacy and your family wiped out and burned in a, in a huge firestorm, in a, in a huge fire tornado. The thing is, it's... It's just so incredibly disproportionate. It's one mistake. Yes, I, I, I give it. It's absolutely excessive. It has been exploited to the maximum. You know how I play the game. I go, I go hard or I go home. I do everything to the absolute maximum. Of course, that's a very bad um, excuse for, for doing what I've done. But the thing is, yes, I have completely fucked up this thing. I admit every fault on that. It's not a miscommunication of them of any way. I was fully aware of what I've, I've been doing. And I was fully aware that these um, that these penalties may apply. But the thing is, it, again, it's one mistake. It's one mistake after three and a half years. And I get to be permanently suspended. It's not a three month ban or a six month ban, which would have fucked with me in a number of ways already. Being three months suspended or six months suspended, even three months would be bad because I wouldn't get all of these subscriber rewards because I can't be subscribed while I'm being banned. So that means that I don't get to get all of the Nico or Car things, you know, that lead up to Knights of the Fallen Empire. I don't get to have that. And for me, that is very. Um, that's a severe punishment. I, I, I just need all of that. You know, all of the investment of time I had put into the game. Up until this point, you know, I, I get 23 uh, mail when I create a new character. And I'm very proud of that, that, that every single thing I can attain through being an invested player, I have attained. I have got the friend referral, I have got the um, subscribe, I've got the pre-order bonus, I've got everything. And not having a certain bonus already is kind of hurtful for me. But I think I deserve that. I do deserve that. What I don't deserve is never being able to access anything I have done in the last three and a half years ever again. It's very hard to maintain composure here. Now the thing is, six months ban, I have been, I would be on board with that. I would say like, fucking hell, you know, it's half a year ban and stuff like that. But like even, even a year's ban, ban work, I would be like, whoa, that's, that's severe. But also what I have done is severe, you know, it was very severe. Um, how I, you know, lessened uh, essentially the experience for many other players, you know, through introducing so many credits into the game that should, don't belong there. I understand the economic damage I have dealt and how, you know, how um, hurtful that must have been for, for other players' experiences and stuff like that. And I, I regret that. Really, I do. I don't, I don't think that was good. I have done a big mistake in a time of my life where I have been stressed anyway, and I have not been prone to make good decisions. 
So making this decision was of course a big mistake. A big mistake which means that now three and a half years of my time investment into a game have been now invalidated. That doesn't happen in other games. It just doesn't. Yes, I'm an exploiter, I'm dirty, I deserve punishment, but not that. Not that. Even the people in, in World of Warcraft, for example, even the people that bot, you know, botting is something I think is quite despicable, and I don't really understand why you would need to bot, but um, some people like to do it and stuff like that, and the people who get caught, they get banned. They, they, they get banned for, for six months, you know, even if they are very highly engaged players, like Hansel recently got banned for uh, leveling his uh, alt very uh, renowned um, World of Warcraft PvP player, and of course they have no consideration for his standing. They of course apply the punishment, and that is how it should be. But a six month ban means you can come back to your account after enough time. You know what, what I would have done if I would have been banned for six months or so? I would just play another account. I would of course be completely screwed over internally and be like, well, that's kind of bad and all of these benefits I don't have and I'm severely punished for that. But I know that I can come back to something. I know that everything I've done is not lost. I can come back to it. And I would have just, you know, made videos with another account. But I, I can't start over. Why would I do that? Part of me wants to do that, but I think in the current state, the game isn't good enough to warrant me just starting all over again. Part of the reason why I still played this game so intensely and so thoroughly was because of all of the things that held me in the game. The reason that I had all of the time invested into it. That I had all of these characters. Now that all of that is gone, essentially, I don't know what, um, I don't know what to make of it. I, for some part of me just wants to push through it, just wants to say, well, you know, I, I just go hardcore, I'm a hardcore gamer, you know, I just start a new account and do everything again, why not? I could do that, I could certainly do that, and I thought about doing that, but, I don't know, in its current state, it's just, I'm, I'm just so totally screwed over right now. It's something I can do. What, of course, mean, does that mean for the, uh, for the account right now, for the, for the channel? Um, sorry for rambling so, so long about these things, just have to express kind of what's going through my mind here. Now, what does that mean for the channel? I'm very sorry for anyone who has recently res um, subscribed to the channel because that means essentially that um, no real Star Wars content is being able to be put out right here unless, you know, I really, you know, play on different accounts and uh, continue that, but I'm not sure about that. You know, I have to, I will keep you updated about this, but for now, if you want to unsub or something like that, I'm not, um, not mad. I'm not mad. Because essentially everything that happened I've brought upon myself. It's just the permanence of the punishment that I'm not quite on board with. That's the only real complaint I have. Everything else is entirely on me here. I'm standing before you and saying, well, I deeply fucked up here. And there's nothing I can do about it. And yeah, I'm sorry, I just... Right now there is no real um, Star Wars content. So what I'm going to do is the following. I'm going to go into myself and of course going to try to... Uh, you know, appeal to them, but I'm not, I'm not. I'm not thinking that this is going to work out too well with my account. So maybe I'm going to continue that. Maybe I'm going to play different games on here. For now, this is um, the announcement of a break on this channel. So I'm just going to take some time off, play some different games, and maybe think about, um, yeah, what to do with all of this uh, in the situation here. Anyway, uh, yeah. Well, if you. Um, yeah, if you comment like, well, you're a cheater, you deserve it, I'm just going to delete your comment because I'm not interested in that kind of discussion. I know that I deserve punishment. I just know that I don't deserve this kind of punishment because this, this completely, it completely invalidates my loyalty of, as a customer for the last three and a half years on the basis of having one mistake in a bad time of my life. Well, anyways. So, I'm going to keep you updated about all of this and I'm sorry... As I said, it's very hard to maintain composure because it is my account. It is my time that I've invested into the game. All of my free time of the last three and a half years essentially went into this thing. So you can really say I'm a no-lifer and I just got killed because my no-life yeah, has just been suspended permanently. So, yeah, that's that. Anyway, I'm going to make sure that I'm going to keep you updated um, when I make decisions and plans on what to do with all of you know this channel and stuff like that. But, you know, for now, nothing new is going to come. So, you know, and you know why. Anyway, my name is Andrulic, and you've not been watching Duke VP, you have been watching a sobbing mess.
So that's that.